Hey guys, hello and welcome back to another new video. Today I'm going to show you how you can create a Discord server. If you are new, if you are a beginner, no problem because I'm going to show you how to create a Discord server that looks nice from scratch. So uh, without wasting much time, let's get started. Okay, uh, so the first thing that you need to do is obviously download Discord. So just hit download and once it is downloaded, install Discord and make sure to log in. Once you have logged into Discord, just open it up and it will look something like this if you have logged in. So these are all the servers that you are in. So just scroll down a bit until you see this plus icon. Hit the plus icon and hit create my own server. If you have some templates right here, you can just choose any one of them if you like. But as I told you, I will be creating a server from scratch. So create my own server for me and my friends, for a club or community. Okay, so that, so that depends on your personal choice. And let's name it a test server. And for the image, let's just put this image and create. So we have a server ready and it's very very basic it literally has nothing one voice channel one text channel and obviously there's me so the first thing is you need to add some more text channels and some more voice channels for people to hang out because you don't want people to just join the server and look at this very very bland server right like who would want to talk in such a server right which literally has nothing so let's start first of all you can see this is called the category and this one starting from hashtag is the text channel so first of all right click the category and let's rename it to uh, welcome now uh, let's rename this text channel as well from general to uh, welcome say changes and Let's create one more channel and obviously we want it to be text. Let's name it rules. Okay, so this is the welcome category. So any new member joins will be shown here and the rules for the server will be shown here, right? So either you can just go ahead and edit the permissions individually, if you like, or else you can just edit the category and this will the permissions in this category will apply to both of these channels so click edit category go to permissions and we haven't created any roles yet we will talk about it later so let's do this for everyone because obviously we want anyone who joins the server to see welcome and rules right so view channel obviously and just scroll down send messages no we just we just want them to look at the welcome screen and the rules we do not want people to send messages in them right scroll down and you will see read message history make sure to enable this because if this is disabled any new member who joins we won't they will not be able to see the messages because those are the old messages and if you do not give them permission they won't be able to see them save changes and you can leave the rest as it is so the permission that i gave to the welcome channel has been applied to this welcome as you can see and this rules as well now let's create another category by pressing this down arrow and hit category create category and let's name it a uh, general and in general we want text channel obviously and let's name it chit chat and we want one more channel and let's name it uh, clips where people can share their sh short clips or videos and let's create one more and let's name it media so that people can share any other media like not only videos but photos as well Okay, so we have general with three text channels right here. Let's create something more, right? 
let's create another category and name it game comps and let's make it a voice channel right and suppose me and my friends are playing valorant and when playing valorant i want to connect to a voice channel that is vc and we have a valorant voice channel so whenever i play valorant with my friends i can just join the voice channel with them and if you're a csgo player like me you can just create another channel named csgo okay and one more so that depends like i have created three you can create more or you can just leave it as a single one and so we have quite a bit here and let's remove this general one as well okay so we have welcome we have general we have game comms let's create something more because it's still kind of empty right so create category and let's name it fun okay so uh that is enough i guess for now in the future you can obviously go ahead and create many more channels depending on your requirements so uh this looks kind of bland right now i mean it's kind of boring because if someone joins your server it's gonna look really really plain you know so it's not really good so let's uh put some emojis right here so just click edit channel and in here welcome you can put an emoji and for that you can just hit windows and semicolon on your keyboard and let's find a hug emoji and there you go okay so uh it looks way better now isn't it now uh let's suppose you are a creator you are an influencer and you want to announce the new things that are going on on the server or on your social media platform so you want to make announcements right so let's create an announcement channel and let's name it announce events and let's drag it over and it should be a text channel let's suppose it is new videos right and as you can see in the permissions and the overview we cannot set it to announcements at all because there is a feature of making the channel to announcement only but you don't see that thing here right so what you can do is click on the drop down and go to server settings you will see enable community hit get started and make sure you have verified email address check both boxes and rules or guidelines uh let's select rules and because this is the channel where we will put rules for the server community updates channel we do not have any so let's just leave it to create one for me next and check all these boxes and finish setup so it's done and you can see you have a moderator only so you and the server mod can see this now uh, it is supposed to be an announcement channel so click edit channel and you can see announcement channel thing has appeared here which wasn't there earlier so it's new videos and you can see the simple change so here we can tell about hey everyone new video is out right so if okay just leave that option that's not really our concern for now okay so uh, you can post like this so in the announcement channels nobody can send messages but you only the permission obviously if you feel like view channel obviously so that people can see it and read message history obviously and 
send messages no nope. we just want to announce we don't want people to send messages in here now uh, we have created the server it looks good but what if someone joined the server right let's suppose let's add a bot uh, let's add yak pdb okay so you can see let's add this bot select server and let's add this to test server right continue and you can see what all the bot can do so we don't want to ban and kick just leave it as it is for now let's authorize let's complete the capture it's complete okay nice okay you can see the bot joined right and in the welcome screen what you saw is everyone welcome yak pdb.xyz and it's kind of boring because so instead we're gonna call me6 to our rescue oh i just typed call me6 <laughs> me6 and why me6 i will tell you just wait select the server so uh, let's add it to test server and continue authorize now you can see uh, just scroll down until you see welcome send a message when a user join the server just enable it and select the channel let's select welcome and what should be the message hey user welcome to the server this is the default message and just click save you can just go ahead and edit it and let's you can see me6 also joined the server and the messages were kind of bland so let's kick yak pdb out of the server and let's invite it again and see what the message is this time So you can see, hey Yak PDB, welcome to the test server. This is the message that is gonna appear now. And it is way better than this previous one. And you can see, along with this message, we have this one as well. So let's just remove this one. And you can see in the overview, send a random message when someone joins the server, so just disable it. What this will do is, it won't send this message anymore. Instead, our me6 will send this message or you can just go ahead and customize this message as per your choice hey user welcome to the server uh, hope you enjoy your stay here so we have updated the message okay so uh, I was editing right now and I noticed something that I forgot to tell you that you have to enable that show card thing as well and it will look something like this well that being said now you may continue watching the rest of the video let's kick yak pdb one more time uh, okay and let's add it again okay this time you can see hey yak pdb welcome to the test server hope you enjoy your stay here and this time this random message that used to appear is not appearing anymore so as new members enter they will be greeted this way by me6 and obviously they won't be able to send messages but only see that oh a new member has joined and let's talk about rules here rules you can put simple rules uh, like on my main server you can see uh, rules section here let's copy these rules and paste these in here so these are the rules that the person has to follow who is in the server so that's the basic design of a discord server and if you are new i hope this video would have been helpful for you creating your own server and in case you want to see how a proper server looks like this is my own server that i created myself you can see welcome different people entering 
rules, information about myself, self rules, booster, booster perks, and new video as you can see. Announcement channel telling about new videos, live stream, server updates, general chat, rank check, memes, self promotion, different voice channels right here, game chats, and reaction role and stuff, voice channels, and different different things. So you can do the same, right? So this was a basic design. You can go ahead and add more to this depending on your creativity. If you have any questions or if you want any suggestions, you can go ahead and join my Discord server. You will find me there and I will try my best to help you out.